I can say uh mm, pal uh, I I I uh con con hello creators I hope you are doing good now today in this video I will show you the difference between the liquid how to choose and why I choose both yeah I use both and I will show you my last uh, last paintings which I have done some experiments on them so that I can say you some uh, tips on it okay so let's get started you will get a bottle one and a tube one. so this is I think 200 yeah absolutely 200 and this is 310 I use both okay so in the individually then talk what actually difference means so these are the tubes uh, if you didn't watch the last video of unboxing of acrylic uh, materials you just go and watch it it was amazing and I've got good response in it thank you so much for that so these are the tubes I will show you the paints see they are so much so you can see how bad it looks uh oh Sorry. okay so in this actually it's not a postal color it is an acrylic colors of camelic both are same company but they are somewhat different i will show you uh, which color shall i think about some color let's pick randomly okay which color crimson and yeah thank you bye bye yeah so this i will show you the from the inside you can see i have used half uh, when I open this tube, uh, sorry, this bottle, I am feeling like a fevicol. You know the fevicol bottle? That smell it's uh, giving me. So, it's very strong and it's not more odored, but it's good. It's very shiny also. And it's too uh, liquid than the tube one. So, I will show you the uh, painting which I have done with this. This one is my acrylic tubes which I've used a few over also. <laughs> oh, in, uh, I just done only three paintings and it's finished. Almost it is finished. And uh, I just say it's this percent buying this, uh, this amount of, I mean, uh, 40 ml of paints of every color, it's very good because uh, it gives uh, not, it, it is not that much soft and watery has this type of tubes so I just recommend this each pack 100 rupees and this is 310 yeah uh, you will have a question that why we can't take this type of boxes yeah I you can take these boxes if you want any required one I will just say you take like this 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 three colors yeah primary colors you just take this three colors and white is very important in the acrylic so you just buy this and this one take a 40 ml so if you have a basics one small in the how much it is 9 ml it's okay. uh, get this box and uh, at least this tube I have two okay you can take a three four how much you use in your painting how regularly you make your paintings that depends uh, depends on your painting how regularly you do so I don't uh, say you the quantity but you just get it off okay uh, these are very thick so I will show you so I have kept yeah I have shown you the crimson here also I will show you the crimson leg see it's so solid so much uh, I can say it's nice but in acrylic it should be in this uh, I can say uh, what difference in this in this both it's okay before see these are some paintings which I will show you my paintings like this so these are the paintings I will just open them yeah this is my first painting this is my second one you can see neatly second one and this is my third which I have done today only if you want any tutorial from this three you can just get it in the youtube i will just keep a link in the description you will get very nice tutorials on this three 
not in my channel but uh, a professional artist from there i have just learned how to do an acrylic painting I have said you uh, in the last uh, video that i am the beginner in the art uh, acrylic so you can see so these are the differences different paintings which i have done from last two days so here i will explain you what i have done here i have used this precious uh -oh. sorry these are paints right sorry <laughs> Okay, I have used in this uh, this, this, and this, uh, and more white. These paints I have used, and this is my homemade canvas which I have made at home. It is very good, and actually, it is rough in these places because I didn't use the uh, gesso in this, so please avoid that. Uh, I will I am buying the gesso very soon so I'm not getting time because of this lockdown okay so this I have made with this paints I have didn't used uh, this bottle only this bottles I didn't use this bottles and I have got some rough textures on the in the background it is very good but I just have got some problem on here when I just uh, I have didn't used any the palette because here in this I just uh, drop the paints here directly and just done it so if, if you have if you watch that video you will get what actually I want to see so check in description and this is my first paint I just impressed but because of homemade canvas oh I don't want to talk anything <laughs> okay yeah this one uh, I have done with this paints only this also I have done with this I've got good results, big, uh, but I have got some rough textures in the background. See, see, see. If you have any doubts about the acrylic, you just comment down. I will try to uh, get to know you very fastly. Okay. And uh, I didn't use this again. I'm seeing you because I just thought that that one is very good, but this changed my my opinion okay so in this i have used the both yeah so actually after this two paintings i have just asked my ma'am who is my drawing teacher my system art teacher that's the suma ma'am so i have asked the, so she said me uh, that use this acrylic for background and use this for your uh, detailings or a uh, pointed or any important points so you for only background you use this it will give you an awesome look so I have used you can see the difference of the background here see the difference how rough it is how smooth it is so I just uh, I said said okay and I just tried today so I've got the good reason so I thought to share with you so what actually this both uh, have means I will tell you here yeah this both so this is very uh, like jelly and it is very liquid in the liquid form so I can uh, say you anything that uh, take a particular painting or in if you want to choose any one uh, uh, for beginners this both are very use useful so I just say them to use this too I'm also using so please use this two types of I'll keep the links so this both are camlin AP okay so these are the bottle and the tube differences uh, which by combination of this two material I have made an awesome painting you can see so this is the difference which I have just like this uh, type of uh, finishing and I have made every painting on my homemade canvases so you can see homemade canvases this both are actually homemade and this actually this paper is my uh, have got from the collection of pads that uh, watercolor I uh, sorry acrylic pads which have got paper so I've just pasted on the cardboard so it became the canvas so I can hang anywhere so bonus tip 
I will just uh, say you that today's bonus tip use this both and uh, use this in the background and this in your uh, all detailings and important works for background this is the best so you can use this but you will feel that it would be very dry and dumb so I will say to use this so thank you for watching this video please like share comment subscribe my channel i think you have understood what actually an acrylic uh, bottle and the tube differs and you will get an idea of which one is the best for you and palettes uh, how see did you only have done i didn't even clean my palette also actually it is not a palette this is also camlin 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 okay okay watercolors cakes so i just removed that cake it was very dried and boring so i just removed and using for has a palette so in the comment section tell me uh, if you want to make your own homemade canvas so that uh, if you want any one uh, homemade canvas so i will make a tutorial on this too so how i have uh, prepared this this type of canvas and this one also i will show you if you want please comment down so that i will get to know you want that mm. okay thank you for watching bye i have said you so many times like please